Better Call Saul Season 3 finale just went off, entitled Lantern. And I thought it was a decent episode. Um, it's come along with a decent season in general. Um, well, this season had a lot of slow burn to it, but I think it worked out pretty well overall. Um, dealt with some with the accident with Kim last week. Um, breaking, broke her arm. Uh, Saul had to go over and try and help find some of the papers that were scattered on the side of the road. Um, Saul helped, went over to check on Chuck. was amazed by the electricity being on. Um, so I had a bit to deal with this week. Um, even with the lawsuit that was going on and had convinced some people to commit to it. Um, looks like they might be backing out. Finally fessed up to being kind of sleazy. Um, but he fixed it, corrected it, so lawsuit is going to be put back into some turmoil with trying to deal with uh, with, uh, with all the parties there. Um, Chuck had a rough time uh, dealing with Howard and some of the firm. Thought originally he had offered a couple things like a lawsuit with them or possible retirement, but they couldn't really afford it. Um, turns out the deal was three million dollars for three payments. So it ended up being nine million dollars total, which Howard ended up helping to pay some out of pocket, even though Howard's been another great actor with Michael McKeon. Um, can't remember Howard's name, but he's been hurt by Chuck and Saul, I think, so it's been interesting seeing him deal with each of those characters separately um, throughout the show. Um, Kim was having a little struggles of her own um, dealing with some of the litigation that she had dealt with and the accident and uh, she's, she was working too hard and had a rough go of it fell asleep. Um, Nacho was dealing with Hector and his plan finally came to fruition um, as far as Hector finally dropping. Um, sounded like he was on the medicine for his heart, had a heart attack. Um, Gus was there, tried to do some CPR. Um, looks like he's still alive, of course. Um, from Breaking Bad, looks like, I mean, he had a stroke at some point. So maybe this heart attack's leading up to some sort of stroke incident. Um, it's not looking good for him. Uh, but he gets so hot-tempered and angry. Uh, he has a hard time dealing with his, uh, he's just so aggressive. Can't deal with it. Um. And it's going to be rough for Saul and Chuck. Um, there are a couple of cliffhangers um, there at the end. One was the fire in Chuck's home that he set after kind of had a breakdown after Saul came over and dealing with the law firm, um, set the gas running. Couldn't, couldn't quite find the last little bit of power that was in his house. So he just kind of lost it, set the uh, gas going, and knocked over a lantern, started a fire. Um, not sure what's going to happen with him. Is he going to be alive, or is it going to be some tragic going to happen with him next season, or between seasons? Um, it's going to be rough for uh, Saul, since the last thing they had there was a, quite a bit of a heated argument, or a heated talk discussion. Um, It'd be, it'd be rough for Saul, the last thing he had with his brother was a disagreement. Um, but I'm sure they'll touch on that next season with how Saul develops into the person he is in Breaking Bad. Um, you know what's going to happen with Hector? Um, is he going to be in any shape or form? capable of 
performing at any level um, that it was before? Is he just going to be wheelchair bound? Um, is that stroke going to happen at some point? Um, we're not sure. And it looks like Saul uh, and Kim moved out of their office space. And Saul was moving towards another space. And my guess would be it's going to be the area he had in Breaking Bad with the Statue of Liberty on top and that little strip mall. So that to me opens up him opening the skeevy lawyer business that he had. Um, Badger might show up. Skinny Pete, can't remember the other guy's name with the little mohawk, but who knows, he, maybe even Jesse might pop up, or Walt at some point, they pass each other somewhere down the road, I don't know, should be interesting, it's a pretty good season, I thought, um, I feel like the show's gotten, getting better every, every season, so can't wait for season four, finally pop up. Probably next year sometime since it seems to go a year between the uh, seasons. And I'm going to call it here. I'll see you next time.